because of the Lord's mercies. I don't want to see great love. Aha. It is of the Lord's mercies that we are not consumed. But for the Lord's mercies, I don't know what would have happened to Sister Christie. I declare 2016 shall be your year of mercies. In the name of Jesus. He says because his compassions, they fail not. Guess what? They are available every morning. Every morning from this morning throughout 2016, as you wake up, you collide with God's compassions. You collide with his gratefulness in the name of Jesus. I declare by reason of information, I know what next year is. By the mercies of the Lord, next year you will live without toiling. I said you will live without toiling in the name of Jesus. Okay, let's do Psalm 44, 26. And then we'll pray for our five minutes. Hallelujah. Arise for our help. And redeem us for thy mercy's sake. I began to try to understand what the Lord was talking about. For thy mercy's sake. And please forgive me. Uh, the only way it came to mind, Pastor Femi, to explain the scripture is this. Say, for example, you are a Man United fan. And I come to you. And I said, for Man United sake, you better fire Louis Van Gaal. <laughs> Hallelujah. It means there is a problem with Louis Van Gaal. And so that things can get better, you need to get rid of him. So what David is doing here is calling out God's mercies. He said, for your own mercy sake, you better arise and help me. And I know for a fact that that mercy is available this evening. That mercy will see you into 2016. That mercy will speak for you through 2016. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, Exodus 33, 19. Exodus 33, 19. Exodus 30. Oh, it's, uh, next year is lovely. Next year is awesome. Next year is fantastic. Next year is great. Uh -uh. Next year, I'm telling you, by the mercies of the Lord, you will not toil. You will not struggle. In the name of Jesus. It says, 33 3 3 and he said I will make all my goodness pass before thee and I will proclaim the name of the Lord before thee and will be gracious unto whom I will be gracious I don't know if that person is in church for this crossover service and will show mercy on whom I will show mercy. Somebody here next year will not be qualified. But he will be called. And God will qualify you. Where you are not expected to eat, you will eat. Where you are not expected to make it, you will make it. Where you are not expected to be, you will be there. In the name of Jesus. Help me get up and shout hallelujah. I need a believing hallelujah. I want you to pray like this. My father, my father, by your mercy, in 2016, every trap set on me and my family, let it backfire now in the name of Jesus. Open up your mouth and begin to pray in 2016. By your mercy, oh Lord, by your mercy, oh God, every trap that is set for me and my family, let it backfire, let it backfire, let it backfire. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. Open up your mouth and pray. 2016 is your year. Everywhere they've said you will not make it, you will make it by the mercy of the Lord. Open up your mouth and pray. Hallelujah. In Jesus' precious name we have prayed. How many people know that if you pray the word of the Lord, it's a must that it must come to pass? It's a must. He says, my word will never go forth and come back without having accomplished that which it was sent to do. 
I'm sending the message of the Lord into your lives for 2016. It is on an errand in your life, in my life, me that I'm praying, that everywhere I go, my enemies will be at peace with me. Mercy will speak for me. Mercy will heal you. Mercy will promote you. Mercy will give you a new house. Mercy will give you a new car. Mercy will give you a new job. In the name of Jesus, shout, by mercy, O oh God. Show me favor that will stand me out in the year 2016 in the name of jesus open up your mouth and begin to pray by your mercy oh lord show me favor show me favor that will stand me out in the year 2016 stand out my family in the year 2016 stand out my children in the year 2016 stand out the works of my hands in the year 2016 aha uh -huh. yeah 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 as you have spoken in the ears of the Lord, so shall it be in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' precious name we have prayed. My father, my father, call him like he's your real father. Let me hear it a little bit louder. Say it like your life depends on it. Give me an outstanding miracle that will glorify you in my life. In the name of Jesus, open up your mouth and begin to pray. My father, my father, in the year 2016, give me an outstanding miracle that will glorify you in my life. Give me an outstanding miracle. That will glorify you in my life. In the year 2016. Give me an outstanding miracle. Yeah, 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 yeah. In Jesus. Precious name we have prayed. My father, my father. Every caged benefit of mine. Or blessing before 2016 let it be released by your mercy in the name of Jesus meaning in the next hour every blessing of yours that has been held back is going to come out is going to come out by your mercy oh Lord every case benefit of mine let it be released before 2016 By your mercy, O oh Lord. Pray for your family. By your mercy, O oh Lord. Every cage benefits of my family that has been held. Let it be released before 2016. Most gracious God, no tender voice like them can peace upon. And I need thee, oh, I need thee. Hey, every hour I need thee, oh, bless me now. My Savior. Yeah. Just lift up your hand and appreciate him and his order. No matter how big a man claim to be, you can't be bigger than God. No matter how a man claim to be anointed, he or she should remember that there's somebody in charge of the anointing. can seize it at any time that nobody can query him.